with meteorologist Brandon Lashbrook. Well, after we dried out from Francine a couple days ago, we had some rain today, and here's all that's left of Francine over northern Mississippi. Not much left of it, just some rain over northern Alabama and the low pressure center that is kind of sliding off to the south with the frontal boundary, and that kicked off some of these showers and some storms that we saw here locally across southeast Louisiana today. Now, all that rain this evening has pushed off to the south. You see all that's left of it is just some showers near Thibodeau, near New Iberia, and we will be drying things out as you go throughout, throughout the rest of tonight, although we may, we may see some patchy fog a possibility as we go over near sunrise. But out the door right now, though, 80 degrees. It feels like 86 degrees thanks to dew points in the mid 70s. So it's a little bit humid out the door right now thanks to that rain that added that moisture near the surface. And because of that, we have a chance for some patchy fog a possibility near sunrise before that begins to mix out later in the morning. And our lows will be into the upper 60s and lower 70s. Now tomorrow's highs will be very similar to what we saw today in the mid to upper 80s and that humid Humidity is still a little bit high, so we'll have our heat index value still manageable, however, in the lower to mid 90s under partly cloudy skies for your Sunday. Now, we do have a chance for a couple isolated showers for the day, but most of us should stay on the drier side for our Sunday. In rain chance, should be confined to more coastal areas for the late morning hours into the early afternoon hours as its front digs down from the north and brings that rain chance along the coastal regions for tomorrow. But then by Monday, here comes that upper level low sliding down from the south to provide a little bit more lift for more storm activity. So Monday should, should see some more storm and shower coverage across the area throughout the afternoon hours for some scattered showers and some storms. And highs will also be into about the upper 80s, near 90 degrees or so with a scattered shower and storm chance in the late afternoon hours as well and heat index values will be still pretty manageable in the lower 90s. However, as we go through the new work week, we'll be getting a little bit more drier and a little bit more warmer as well as high temperatures. Labor will remain into the upper 80s, lower 90s, just about average. Our average high is 89 degrees for this time of year. But our heat index values, they will be rising up a little bit as we go into the new work week. Lower to mid 90s, maybe even some upper 90s by Wednesday, Thursday. However, still pretty manageable overall as we remain main near average for those high temperatures throughout this next up upcoming work week. But as you go through early Monday, we'll have a chance for scatter showers and some storms out there. Highs into the upper 80s. Morning low is pretty steady in the lower 70s and upper 60s. An isolated shower and storm chance for on Tuesday, even more isolated by Wednesday. And then beyond that, we are more sunny and dry as we finish off the new work week with highs near 90 degrees.